Hey everybody, here's an update with Jesse Smollett. The mystery surrounding the alleged assault of Empire actor Jesse Smollett is growing. Welcome to Religion Link TV, where my spiritual ears stay. Last night, police released two men who've been detained for questioning earlier in the week. Carter Evans now has more on the unanswered questions that remain. The two Nigerian brothers arrested in connection with the assault on Empire actor Jesse Smollett are no longer suspects. They're now cooperating with police. A source close to the investigation confirms to CBS News the brothers told detectives Smollett paid them to participate in the alleged attack on January 29th and that they purchased a rope found around Smollett's neck at a nearby hardware store. The source says detectives have evidence to corroborate the sale, something the men's attorney alluded to Friday night. New evidence that was brought to their attention. Obviously, I had it. Obviously, my clients had it. Police say the two men, identified as Ola and Abel Osendairo, were captured on surveillance video when Smollett said he was attacked. There's any justice. Ola Osendairo is connected to Smollett through the hit show Empire, where he played a prisoner in season two. Both brothers apparently left Chicago for Nigeria on the day of the alleged attack and were detained when they returned this past Wednesday. Chicago detectives tore through an apartment looking for clues and evidence log shows they found ropes, masks and bleach. Chicago police released the brothers Friday night without charges. A spokesman says detectives have additional investigative work to complete. He said this MAGA country punches me right in the face. In a recent interview, Smollett said he was sure the men in the photo were his attackers. I think that what people need to hear is just the truth. Jesse Smollett still hasn't spoken publicly about the brothers' arrest or their subsequent release. Chicago police said earlier this week they are still treating Smollett as a victim and not a suspect. Yeah, I will not allow myself to lose my mind or go crazy over this story. How far will you go? I know some of y'all daydreaming that this wasn't true and that Jesse would just overcome this. And then some of y'all are just still sleep to the fact that this man made this story up like a little girl daydreaming about her coronation. I don't know what's going on in his mind, but reality does not sit well with Jesse. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. What is going on with these people? Well, just like David Ruffin would say, What's going on here? What's really going on, y'all? Y'all can't see the lies that Jesse Smollett has told before the masses, before the world, for whatever selfish reasons are in the world, for whatever selfish reasons are intentions of ill heart. I'm going to sit here like this woman and laugh my ass off because it is what it is. I am going to laugh my ass off all the way to the White House because that's where this was headed. Lee Daniel done wrote some damn script that got the whole world going crazy. Feeling sorry for a young black gay man that said he was almost attacked or attacked in the worst way possible by two racist white guys. And I showed you Kanye with the two white men in the last video. Go check that video out. But in the meantime, and in between time, man, this is one you can chuck up in the air with laughter because it's crazy. It's silly. It's nonsense. It's bullshit. I have no reason to be mad over it, and neither should you. I mean, the bottom line is... Jesse Smollett on January 29, 2019 felt it within his spirit, within his soul, within his mind to concoct the story to call the police the Chicago Police Department and tell them he was assaulted in what is known as a hate crime so I'm going to go ahead and celebrate that because once again this should be enough tea for you it then set black people back damn near a million years back where the dinosaurs are forget slavery so y'all have a great day shalom let me know what your thoughts are down below bye oh 
because my name is Religion Link TV, and over here, my spiritual is staying.